Well, the secret too to a lot of seventies team is having a good collar, a decent collar. Has anyone seen my Corvette? <laughs> I lost my Corvette. <laughs> Have you seen my Corvette? <laughs> <laughs> Would that be a stingray or? <laughs> yeah, I got a brown, brown stingray. <laughs> no, light blue, powder blue. <laughs> a powder blue. I'm bringing this too. Hey, do you got? You should throw on some doing it right on the wrong side of town. <laughs> Hold on. <sir. laughs> Yeah, it doesn't matter what shirt you got on with that mustache. I just wear a garbage bag. <laughs> 70s garbage bag. A hefty sack. <laughs> I think it, it it also the comb brings a lot more attention to your to your back plate. <laughs> Anyone see my hibachi? <laughs> also, too, you could go with the more sporting theme of the 70s where sportswear became, just in case you want to play a little softball. Yeah, let's, let's get a fucking game of pickup going here. <laughs> you guys want to play some pickup softball? I'll go to my vet and get my bat and my glove. <laughs> and my bases. I got bases. Base bags. In the back of the vet. I fucking love softball. <laughs> Softball's amazing. It definitely adds to wish the... I, wish I had a kimono. <laughs> <laughs> and next when we come back, we'll see if we can find some kimonos to try on. Also because leisure wear and bedtime wear via Hugh Hefner style also became another popular feature. And when you're working a 70s theme party, you've got to think outside the box sometimes. <laughs> Everybody was kung fu fighting. <laughs>